Hey! In this short tutorial I'll show you how to create and monetize a travel directory website like TripAdvisor for free. I'm gonna use WordPress, the most popular website building platform, WooCommerce, the most popular e-commerce plugin, and HivePress, a free plugin for building any type of directory and listing websites. We'll also use the Listing Hive Sim since it's a free, multi-purpose sim that has all the required features for building a travel directory and it's fully compatible with the HivePress plugin. You can follow the link in the description to learn more about HivePress and its sims, check its live demo or ask developers any pre-purchase questions. Ok, so let's start with the sim installation and navigate to the WordPress dashboard first. Since Listing Hive is a free theme, you can install it directly from the WordPress dashboard by going to the Appearance Themes page and then clicking Add New. Next, find it via the search bar and proceed by installing it. Finally, click on the Activate button. Once activated, it will display a suggestion to install the HivePress plugin. Proceed by clicking the recommended plugins link and then start the installation. Now simply click the return link and proceed by activating HivePress. Now let's add some extra features to your travel directory to extend its core functionality. Navigate to the HivePress extensions section. This is the list of available HivePress extensions that you can purchase or install for free. For our travel directory, let's install the following extensions. Favorites – to let users keep a list of favorite listings. Geolocation – to enable the location-based search. Reviews – to allow users to rate and review listings. And finally Messages – to allow users to send private messages. Also. You can install the Claim Listings extension to enable directory monetization later. Simply click on the Install button and activate the extension once it's installed. Then follow the same steps for other extensions you want to install. In this video I'll skip the installation of other extensions since it's the same. The next step is to split your directory into categories depending on the types of listings you want to have on your website. For example, the main TripAdvisor categories include things to do, hotels and restaurants. To add a new category, navigate to the Listings Categories section. Here you can enter the category name, for example, let it be things to do. Here. You can enable hierarchy by setting a parent category. Then fill in the description if necessary. And upload the category image. When finished, click on the Add Category button. In the same way, you can add as many categories as required for your directory. For example, hotels and restaurants categories. Once you are done with categories, it's time to add some fields specific to travel directory listings. You can add custom listing fields in the Listings Attributes section. Click on the Add New button. For example, Let's add the price attribute, so users will be able to set the price when they are looking for some activities nearby. Here, select the number field type and allow front-end editing, so users can specify the price when adding a new listing. Then, mark it as filterable, sortable and select the search field type. It's better to select the number range field type, so that users can set a price range according to their budget. Finally. Define how the attribute value appears on the listing pages by setting its display format. Once you are done, click on the Publish button. In the same way, you can add more custom attributes, depending on your travel directory niche and requirements. Alright, now 
it's time to add a new listing. For example, let's add the first listing to the things to do category and do it from the front end to check how it's gonna work for users. To do this, go to your website, click on the add listing button and select the things to do category. Here you can upload the listing image, enter the listing title, let it be city tour, specify the location, set the price and fill in the description. Finally, submit it. Now, let's set up a front page for your travel directory. It's crazy easy to add and customize new layouts since HivePress is integrated with the WordPress block editor. In order to add a new page, go to the WordPress dashboard, Pages, Add New section. Firstly, fill in the page title. Now let's add some layout blocks. For example, let's add the listing search form. Simply click on the plus icon and select a block you want to add. In the same way, you can add a block that displays listing categories. And another one that displays recently added listings. Once you finish customizing the page content, you can publish it. To use it as a front page, navigate to the settings, reading section and select it from the drop down list. Then save changes. Now Let's take a look at the home page and the new layout we have just designed. Go to your website. Here you can see the blocks we added and also the optional location search that we enabled by installing the geolocation extension. Let's also check the things to do category and try searching for a listing we added. As you can see, the listing is displayed along with the price attribute value, and we can set a price range for searching listings. That's it! Now you have a fully functional travel directory and you can start monetizing it by charging business owners for claiming their listings. Since we already installed the claim listings extension, we only need to install the WooCommerce plugin to enable payments. Go to the WordPress dashboard. Plugins Add New section and find it via the search bar. Then proceed by installing and activating it. Once you activate WooCommerce, it will automatically launch its setup wizard. You should go through all the steps to set up payments for your travel directory. But I'll skip it in this video since every website has its own unique details and payment methods. Ok, now let's add a WooCommerce product that will be used for the listing claim payments. To do this, navigate to the WooCommerce products add new section. Here you can set the product name, its price, and mark it as virtual. Once you are done, publish it. Now go to the HivePress settings page, claims section, and select the WooCommerce product you have just added. Then save changes. Let's check how it works on the front end. Go to your website and view any listing page. As you can see, there is an option for business owners to claim their listings, and once the claim is paid and approved, they will be able to edit the listing details and reply to messages. This way you can easily monetize your travel directory and turn it into a profitable online business. That's how it works! So, if you decided to build a travel directory website like TripAdvisor using WordPress, Keep in mind that you can easily create it with the Listing Hive theme 
and the Hive Press plugin. They are both free, lightweight and suitable for building any type of directory and listing websites. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or you can follow the link in the description to learn more about Hive Press, its themes and extensions. Have a great day!